My name is Juliet and I did the exchange um, to Peru four years ago. It was really cool actually. It was, it was difficult because I just started Spanish a year ago and the parents that I was staying with didn't speak any English. So I was kind of stuck in situations where sometimes I had no idea what to say. I guess it just makes you learn really quickly. Like I learned Spanish very, very quickly when I was there. Okay, so I think my biggest fear was being away from my family for so long because of course I've been away like on summers without my parents but I'd always had like a family member there with me. Whereas here I was going to be in a situation where I was completely alone with people that I didn't know uh, and like staying in a home that I wasn't familiar with, going to a school where I knew no one. So it was a bit scary at the beginning but everyone there was so nice and they knew that I was an exchange student so they made sure that I felt like included. They're all like part of the same, you know, the round square schools. It was just really nice to be in a community that's similar to TWC but with different people. I think my fondest memory from going there was one of the trips that they did. We got to go up to the mountains and the sky was so nice at night. Like it was not nothing like the Singapore sky where you see like one or two stars. It was like full of stars and the food was so good and it was just, it was one of those memories that I like keep with me forever. Um, I joined the Round Square Exchange program in April and it was one of the most amazing and unique experiences. The best part, I have to say, was the weekends where my, my host family took me around Switzerland. So I, get to go, I got to go to the mountains, play in the snow and do some amazing sightseeing I never thought I'd be able to do. One of the challenges was the language barrier in the way that I didn't know any German or French and those are the languages they spoke there. And I had to take lessons in German and French at the school as well which was quite hard because I had three weeks to learn as much as French and German I could. And I actually really enjoyed learning German. I didn't think I would like it, but it was really interesting as I wasn't used to it and I just had like a crash course of um, all the influences around me. And my host family is also Brazilian, so they taught me some Portuguese. I think I learned really how to make decisions by myself and to not have to rely on my parents on each time or what I need to order it in a restaurant to make decisions like if I was going to take French or German in the three weeks I was there. The experience overall may gave me a lot more confidence and I feel more trust in myself at making decisions and getting to know people socially and also my academics as I know how to learn from a different approach. Student-wise there's a huge difference. Um, the way the class actually runs, you know, pretty um, pretty similar, you know, there's class discussions, you know, you do workbook sort of stuff as well. And the kids within my class were really nice as well and welcome them too, which made it easier. It's a really nice experience to be honest. I think you grow from it a bit, you actually gain a lot of independence, like you're kind of forced to be independent otherwise, yeah. Um, and meeting lots of new people, you know, the teaching staff and the students here are really kind. Um, it's an awesome experience. I decided to stay a month and a half. But even if you just want to go for two weeks just to get like a little snippet of experience, you can. Even though it was so long ago, I still look back on it. It was good memories. I really enjoyed it. I think the student exchange program is, is very valuable for all students that are in round square schools and that can experience it. And I think it's an opportunity that every student that can do it should take because I think it, there's a lot of life lessons to be learned. And there's a lot of very, very awesome people to be met as well.